This is becoming a pandemic of the unvaccinated. The CDC director putting it plainly, more than 97% of people hospitalized with COVID right now are not vaccinated. I'm still undergoing a lot of the effects. Charlie in Missouri was among them. I thought, hey, COVID, it's just a form of pneumonia, but it wasn't gonna be that bad. Well, I was wrong. From the ICU, he started taking it seriously. COVID is real. The president today placing some of the blame for people not getting vaccinated on the lies being spread on social media sites like Facebook. They're killing people. I mean, it really, they are, look, the only pandemic we have is among the unvaccinated. And, that, and, they're, and they're killing people. Happy Friday. His spokesperson addressing some of the misinformation today, the false idea that vaccines cause infertility, which is not true. Been disproven time and time again. This is troubling, uh, but a persistent narrative. That the disinformation is spreading as fast as the Delta variant, now affecting more younger Americans, as many elderly people are already vaccinated. Children ages 12 to 15 are least likely to have gotten the shots. 12-year-old Grace Pariseau in Texas just got her shot. We talked about the impacts for the community and our family. We are seeing younger people hospitalized right now, relatively speaking, to a more extent than we were before. And Facebook reportedly responding to the president's words tonight, stating that more than 3 million people have gotten vaccinated through their vaccine finder tool. Facebook saying that it is saving lives instead of causing harm and possibly killing Americans.